tuning in for another delightful segment of Highly Inappropriate with me, your host, Pierre Santavius. So today's topic for discussion is the term swag. So I was on my Twitter the other day and I saw that the term swag was trending, so I just had to see why. So I, 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 there was no particular reason at all. It's not like they put it in the real dictionary or something and people were happy about it. But no, instead, I, I, I found this. Let, let me show you the gold mine that I found. Um, here goes one. He said, I give the best head swag. Hmm, okay. I got mentioned by Justin Bieber today. Swag. I don't know if I'll be able to pay my phone bill, but I got my five dollars for the club. Swag. Okay. So, in case some of you don't know what swag is, it's okay. But at least you're watching this video so you can find out what it means. And to do that, we're going to send you over to the studio with Pierce Ontavius, where he'll give you the true meaning of the, the term swag. Take it away, Pierce. Okay. Hey, everybody. It's Pierce Ontavius. Um, and so I'm in the studio, and I found swag on Urban Dictionary. Um, okay. Uh, one such, uh, def well, there's definitions, and one says uh, appearance, style, or the way he or she presents themselves. Um, okay, that's a really good one. Um, another one says, the way in which you carry yourself. Swag is made up of your overall confidence, style, and demeanor. Uh, swag can also be expanded to be the reputation of your overall swagger. Okay, um, those are just a few of them. And again, they're on that website, so if you don't, if you, if those weren't good enough for you, you can always go on the website. The, it's urbandictionary.com, and there are a lot of useful terms on there. So, um, that's all I have for you today, and, um, back to you, Pierce. <sighs> Thank you, Pierce. Uh, so, now we're back, and let me just go over a few times, a few instances of people using the term swag. Uh, and this is just random, mind you. Okay, um, I just tested positive for AIDS. Swag. Okay, um, I don't think that's something you want to be swagging, you know, that's, I don't think that you have swag by having AIDS. I spent my last $30 on a snap bag and some jeans from Goodwill. Swag. Um, these people are using the term swag inappropriately, so that's why I deem it highly inappropriate. Swag, swag, and swag, swag, swag. Okay, let's just stop this right here. That's highly inappropriate. Ha! You're, this isn't, you aren't using the term correctly. If you, if you don't, if you're using a word and you don't know how to correctly use it, that's just highly inappropriate. I don't know how else to say it. It, it makes you sound ignorant. You're gallivanting around using this this word swag like you, you you think you know what it means, but you don't. If you don't know what a word means, either pick up a real dictionary, and if you don't see it in there, go to the internet and look up the Urban Dictionary. So this has been another delightful segment of Highly Inappropriate. I'm your host, Pierce Montavious. Tune in again. Goodbye.